Okay, many of you folks have returned from March break with pictures and stuff that you want to share with all of your friends here at Appleby. And so we're just going to quickly show you how you can do that within SkyDrive or OneDrive. You're on eSchool's website, and if you click on the SkyDrive, you'll go to all the files you have presently in SkyDrive. And we want to create a folder that we can share with just a few friends of the pictures that we took over March break. So I go to New Document, a bit oxymoronic, but we go to New Document and New Folder, and I'm going to call it Pics from Spain 2014, and click Save. And so now I've got a folder called Pics from Spain 2014, and I'm going to go in it, and I'm going to go to my Dropbox, there we go, and there's my pictures, and so all these pictures here are from Spain, so I'm going to drag, and I can drag and drop them right into the OneDrive folder, and you'll see them uploading. Um, you can also do it one by one upload um, using the regular uploading file process, but sometimes it's easier just to uh, drag and drop. So we've got them all uploaded, and now I'm going to go back up the screen and share the folder with my friends. So the sharing button is just here under the sharing column. Right now it's locked. It's only shared with me, so I'm the only one that can see it. So if I click the little lock, well, I want to invite people. So I'll click on the invite people, and now type your friends' names. Now, the only person in those pictures is Mr. Pashek. So I'm going to invite Mr. Pashek, but I'm not going to allow him to edit it. I only want him to see the pictures. He doesn't get to uh, edit my pictures. He can download them and edit them on his own computer, but my copy, he, uh, he can't change. So hi, Kevin. Here are the pics from Spain. Thanks. And then hit share. And now he's going to get an email pointing him to that folder. Notice the sharing icon has changed from a lock to sharing. I can add more people if I want to um, include Mr. Uh, Peaver or Mr. Palford. I can add them later as well. Uh, and I could po potentially share it with Miss Single and allow her to edit my pictures. Um, and uh, so you can have different level of options for different people. In any case, you've got 25 gig to play with. So eventually, over time, you'll likely fill things up. So you might want to go back later and get rid of the pictures you don't need to keep. Okay, hopefully that's helpful. Thanks very much.